All right, guys, welcome to Atlanta and welcome back to Calvino's World. What I have for you today is a very special October weekend challenge, Mission Impossible Challenge. Why Mission Impossible? Well, for one, I had to slap this video together at the last second. <laughs> So it's going to be a little difficult to follow. So I challenge you to follow. The other thing is there are several events happening this weekend that you should try to get to without missing a single one. Why? Because I'm telling you, it is one of the best weekends that you can have in Atlanta if you try to make it to all these events. It's a very special weekend because I had lots of fun last year. Speaking of which, this is the Brookhaven International Festival. Last year was their first festival and last year was their first one I can't imagine how good this second one's gonna be so just a second ago they showed the Laotian dancers or maybe the Cambodian I am so sorry I hope I don't offend anybody and then just Argentinian or Spanish flamingo dancers or tango dance? Boy, I hope I anyway <laughs> I'm very tired right now I'm trying to get this video out to you as soon as possible another special event Atlanta five points Halloween parade you don't want to miss that man it's so good in addition they, they've made it a two-day event now where they got the, the live punk bands and the skating right next to it all on this same street I, I, I promise you man there's lots of energy um, a little bit of a mosh pit thing going on you don't want to miss that if it's a little too much for you on sunday they got atlanta streets alive uh, this is the west end version grant park to west end very fun also this atlanta hateville chili contest i was very surprised it also was a lot of fun very relaxing way a great way to end saturday night man Oh, okay, all right. Turkey with a kiss of sweetness at the end. Okay, all right. Appreciate it. As well as, man, I hope they invite this lady back, man, this, this musician back. I don't know who she was. This ain't my type of music, but when I tell you she was so good, I couldn't leave. I couldn't leave. I had to keep coming back to, like, like I kept trying to leave, and the music was so good, I, I stayed the whole time. Hello. Yes. Um, so bring a lawn chair for that. This particular event does not conflict with the other. Enjoying yourself so far? I am. All this uh, chili's pretty good. <laughs> we got such a mess Park uh, Fest, man. You don't want to skip that, man. Porch Fest. Um, I'll leave a link to the to, to in the description below and when i tell you man that it's so much fun because the different kind of music i can't even show you all like these were all supposed to be standalone separate videos i just ran out of time to get them to you and it all happens on the same weekend it's just a lot of fun they uh when you go to the halloween fest on friday i mean i'm sorry on sunday the parade don't forget that there's other things that are happening i showed you the skaters earlier i showed you the live band they also have the market just i tell you what go to their website very descriptive because it just it shows you you can see all the different little events that they got going on another reason you don't want to miss the parade like you can go to the market and all that on saturday but you don't want to miss the parade because if you got kids and you are in atlanta and there's a Halloween parade. I'm telling you, they're going to have so much fun, man. Bring the kids. Show them the Halloween parade. Um, but I saw a lot of people like myself that didn't have any kids that went and still had a ball. Uh, now, as far as how I was going to make a much longer video, much more organized, and show you how to go to each event in order. But I don't know which direction you're heading from. I don't know if you're heading from outside the perimeter. I do not suggest driving. Driving is going to be very difficult this weekend. You're going to need a lot of patience. The reason I show you this event that I'm showing you now, which is the Freedom Park Farmers Market, uh, which is on Saturday morning, is I believe it doesn't conflict with anything else. And I went to it because I needed to go up the belt. Well, it was a little bit out of my way, but I was going up here anyway on by bicycle. Checked out the farmer's market. It was cold that day, so it wasn't as many people 
uh, as it was on a later day when I went. Uh, so there'll be a part two to that when it's a standalone video. And it was on the way to the chef's market. And I only went to the chef's market because I was on the way to Oakhurst for the Oakhurst Ports Festival. This chef's market, it is possible, like the Freedom Farmer's Market, to actually skip that because Freedom Farmer's Market happens every weekend. Chef's Market, believe it or not, also happens every weekend. So you can potentially skip this these two events to kind of save yourself some time. But if you were like me and it's kind of on the way, there's no reason to stop by. The point is, the entire point is, just get out and have fun, man. Um, I recommend going to every single one if you can. If you can. This is the Atlanta Streets Alive. This is on Sunday, so you could do this and do the Halloween parade on Sunday. All the other events are mostly on Saturday. Figure it out. But just look how much fun people are having, man. And that's the whole point. And that's it. Um, sorry if it was a little bit jumbled or confusing, out of out of order. Um, you'll have to figure out the logistics for yourself. If you could, stay tuned for a very important message at the very end of this video. I would appreciate it. Stick around, and uh, I'll see y'all next time. I appreciate it. Peace. I hope this video was able to inform or entertain in some way. So if you got anything out of it, please return the love and hit the like button to help me grow the channel. It really does help. And if you have to be going through a difficult time, please remember to get out there and explore for yourself. Live in the moment, live in the now. Take the time to appreciate all the little things and find the joy in life. Tomorrow is never promised. Forget about material matters and simply be grateful for each and every breath. Morning is always a new opportunity. One more chance to start over. And most importantly, just be good to each other. We're all we got. It's really that simple. And as always, I thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video. Peace. did not have the financial means to escape. I was once one of those people. And I can tell you, it feels like the world forgets. Nobody cares. There's NFL games that continue. People having fun, enjoying themselves. Don't forget about those people that are left behind. A lot of them may not even get electricity for the next four weeks. That's how my situation was. And again, there are people playing games and it's unfortunate. They have the power to do something. I can't do anything about those people. But if you're watching this, you have the ability to check out some of these links, vet them for yourself, and decide if you want to volunteer your time or donate your money to help those people down there. And I thank you for it, and I'm sure those people will too.